Hello, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I will show you how to create simmering effect using Smart Animate in Figma application. So let's jump to Figma app, okay? Okay, in this video, you will learn after delay, smooth animate, smooth time transition, and loop transition, yeah? Because uh, in this video, we will learn uh, the animation, the interaction, okay? So uh, the example that I will uh, create is uh, food delivery uh, UI, yeah, food delivery UI. So uh, I will focus to this components. So this component. So now I will create as a symbol or usable asset. And the first thing you need to do is you need to create as a reusable asset or create the component base okay so i will focus on the wireframe this one the food listing with wireframe with a gray color because uh with this component we will create the transition the smooth transition from the wireframe so i will create uh, the component first so okay and next is you need to create as a variant because we will create the interaction from this component okay but uh, uh, my focus if we want to create smooth transition is you need to create you need you need to play in the uh, the gradient the gradient color so i already provide uh, the gradient color that i already used before so i'm using style manager to save the style the color style from another file so actually i already create like this one so i'm i will mimicking this process and show you how to process to create smooth transition into another uh, another document so the goal is uh, you need to uh, you you will learn about the foundation how to create uh, the wire uh, the smooth transition and on a simmering effect so i already i will import uh, import this color and also effect shadow into this document okay now uh, i already generated the color from another file so this is the color style that I already created before so we will we will create into four or uh, five five variant so I will create the five variant because we will create smooth transition into this component If you want to change the name, uh, it's up to you because it is not necessary. Okay, now, uh, now we will change the color into like uh, the transition effect using the gradient color because I already uh, created before and then I just use the uh, the color style now which the uh, which the first transition simmering effect that you want to use from the left or from the right or from the center now to make it easier so i will create the transition from the left so this one so this is the transition uh, from the left and i will duplicate the same thing for for the first variant component and the next is uh, we change the the gradient color transition so this is the white on the left so now we will we will move the white simmer the white yeah, color into yeah slightly on on the, yeah in the center like, yeah so we'll change this one into the center so this one yeah so from the left to the center 
and to the left yeah in the center so one second so i think i will create the left first left second yeah gray left two and this one will be uh, center oops sorry this one will be center gray center this one is uh, gray 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 right and this one will be gray right okay so this this transition from from the left uh slightly left center slightly right and also full right okay uh i don't know what's the name but i think you get what i mean right yeah so, okay now the first the card is already created now is we focusing on prototyping so now we will create the transition between uh card one into card five okay so i will create slightly down like this and then i will create connect one uh one to another so this one uh, so uh, in interaction detail this uh this selection i will change to after delay and i will set 100 millisecond and then this uh, the animation i will change to smart animate and set to linear and then you see, you can set to 150 millisecond and then you can uh uh, make the transition time into all these component into this component variant okay okay for the last variant so you need to make it go go to first you need to connect fifth uh, fifth card or uh, card five into the card one so i will connect to this card one because oh uh, i will use the looping transition so infinity transition tran transition yeah okay this one will set the same thing is after delay we set 100 millisecond and smart animate and linear okay this one is already done okay now if you want to see the 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 result you need to create uh, you can copy this one and then you can set flow start a start point if you want to see the result of the interaction okay i will uh, check the the this animation what's it look like so you need to click the flow one and then i will make separate document to make it easier okay i think is it has some uh need 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 to fix the the transition okay let me check for this one you need to change to 100 pixel or 100 millisecond okay and i think i will change to this one into separate document okay so this is the the example of the the interaction yeah but this is the interaction only for one card because uh, we finish one uh, one component to make it looping transition using or uh, smart animate and after delay okay I think this will be so the transition I assume this will be a smooth uh, transition smooth animation okay okay now uh, the next is we can uh, create the same behavior same uh, transition into another another component okay so now i will create the avatar uh, component so i will create the variant component using this avatar okay i will create the component and then i will create as a variant and I will duplicate into five of oh I will into five variant component but now I will change into constant into left and the top okay I will duplicate into five 
four, three, two, one, go. Okay. Now I will create this the avatar profile. Okay, and then I will change to the same thing. Yeah, the the um, this uh, uh you need to make sure uh, every transition time and also the uh the effect and also the 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 effect transition you need to make it the same like uh the wireframe card All right okay now because I think I don't need to I don't need to uh, see the, the transition okay, maybe uh, in the end if all already selected or already created so I will test at once Okay, the last thing is you need to create the category listing component as the parent component. So follow the same behavior, the uh, same color, uh, same gradient. Okay, now we already created three component and all we we set as the loop animation using the same gradient i mean the gradient color the transition so now we can combine all together into one frame layout okay now we can create it this one so we can replace this one so we can copy and we can replace and this one we can replace and we can duplicate and then we can duplicate again this one the category simmering category effect okay we can duplicate yeah we can duplicate and then this one we can duplicate too yeah so make it easier and then the last thing is we can duplicate the avatar avatar now we can check so don't forget you can set checkpoint so the you can set the start uh, starting point the interaction and then we can check to this one as the flow too and then let's see what we get now tana okay i think i need to set okay okay i think i forgot i need to fix this layer into this one and then we can check again okay now this the wireframing into the simmering effect is already done it's finished and now how we can uh, create the after delay maybe we can set three or five seconds once uh from the simmering effect into the the real product so let's say we already load the data and now what we're gonna do is we can create uh, another uh, frame frame screen like this one but we can change the uh, the cut into the real product so you can uh, you can build the, the component if you want to make it everything simple okay I will change uh, one by one But make sure you set the same uh, the same spacing in between okay and if you want to make it look uh, uh, look dynamic you can uh, change into another uh, image okay and then I will change to this one the avatar
and then if you want to make it everything so dynamic so i will i will depress i will replace into the same image okay let's say this is the uh noodle okay this is, will be drink and then this will be snack okay i think i need i need to change uh, yeah it is the minor thing but if you want to make it more 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 real yeah you need to find unsplash if you want to find a free photos uh, let's say drain okay if you want to change change like this one okay snack snack okay let's say you want to change this one now now we are finished i don't think so you need to connect frame to frame using after delay transition too okay i will connect to frame to to frame and i will set as after what no one second why there's no after delay hmm. okay now we will connect our frame one into the frame two using the same behavior same same interaction is we can use the after delay transition and also smart animation now actually you already, you already uh, see the interaction but i think it's too fast too fast so i will set into five seconds so five thousand milliseconds and let's see the interaction okay i will uh, restart oh sorry i think i need to delete the start point I will set the start point okay and then let's see we can refresh and then let's see the result okay now we already finished create the smooth transition simmering effect okay okay perfect yeah perfecto perfecto okay that's uh, the tutorial of uh, simmering effect using smart animate and after delay I, uh, I hope you like my video and you can uh, share and also if you have a question you can leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe okay see you soon bye bye <coughs>